Hi, I'm Teddy Burris with Google Workspace and Gmail Strategist. And the question I got asked is, can you send encrypted and or secure email through Gmail and Google Workspace? And the answer is yes, and I'm gonna show you how to do that in this video. So it starts right here, Compose. Whether you're in Gmail or Google Workspace, it starts right here. Now, I'm gonna make this bigger screen so you can see it. And you can see right here, I can send this. I'm gonna send it to Teddy Burris of Burris Consulting. And I'm gonna make it, you know, private for your eyes only. And then I'm gonna send him, uh, you know, just a quick text. You know, this is... Now, this is interesting. Because I wrote the word private, and important and do not share it. One of those phrases alerted the confidential mode. Pretty cool, I just noticed that. So, uh, which is what I wanna do anyway. So I've written the message for Teddy Burris. Did I write it to the right person? Let me see, yeah, I did. So now let's go check out confidential mode. Now it wants me to learn more or dismiss this message. I'm just gonna go ahead and click on the icon. Right here it is, toggle confidential mode. Click on that. Now. Recipients won't have an option to forward, copy, print, or download. Once you turn confidential mode on, they cannot forward, copy, print, or download this message. I can set the expiration so this message goes away however fast I want it to go away. Make it one day. Now, I can require a passcode. All passcodes are generated by Google. So I can say send an SMS text passcode or no passcode. Either one. Now I'm gonna use the first one I'm gonna do with no passcode. I'm gonna hit save. Now I'm gonna send this message. Now give me a minute, I'm gonna go to the other account and show you what he gets. There's the email, private for your eyes only. This message was sent in confidential mode, open to view its contents. And because I sent it with no SMS, and because this user uh, TL Burris at BurrisConsulting.com is using the um, Google app. He can view this message. Now I'm going to go check something real quick. Give me a second. I'm going to go look at that message on my iPhone. And I got it on my iPhone, private for your eyes only. Now this is the message that I got on my iPhone when I opened that email up, the secure email. I opened it up in the iPhone mail app because I'm not in a, a Gmail account, I'm not in a, a Google Chrome logged into my Gmail, Go, um, Google is forcing me to open that up into in a Google product so that it can manage the security. Again, you see this message here, which is my iPhone email message. It won't let me view that. When I click on it in my iPhone, if I do that right now, then what it's going to do when I click on that message in my iPhone, I got to click on where it says view the email. It's opening it up in uh, actually just in Google Chrome with confidential mail and it's going to let me view it. Now I want to go back to the account where it was sent and you can see right here is where it was sent private eyes only. Now I'm going to delete this message. I'm done testing it, and notice it's going to say it's going to um, the re recipient will not have access to it anymore because I've deleted it. Now I'm going to send it with SMS code. I'm going to send a new message. Send it to Teddy Burris at Burris Consulting. Make it full screen so you see what I'm doing. Now I'm going to use the secure options down here toggle confidential mode on and I'm going to use SMS code and I'm going to hit save. Now when I hit send, now again it's going to, uh, I let it go for a week this time, but when I hit send it asked me for his um, cell phone number, so I'm going to give him my cell phone number and I'm going to hit send. Now it sent the message but it did not send the text message yet. Now let me show you what I'm talking about. Go to, I'm gonna go to his account. Here's the new message. When I click on that, 
it it doesn't show the message. I have to click send passcode to the number that was chosen when the message was sent. So I'm going to hit send passcode. Now it's going to send the passcode to the text message. Let me go get it. 756, 837, 756, 837. And now I'm going to hit submit. And now I can read the message that was sent securely. So um, you can send a secure message that it, the user, as long as they're opening it up in Gmail, you can send it to them without SMS message. If they're getting the message and they're not in Gmail, it's going to force them to open up in a Google uh, platform like Google or in the, force them to log in a Gmail. If they're opening it up on their cell phone or in Microsoft Outlook. You can send a secure message with SMS code and they can view that message. Now I'm going to go look on my cell phone for your eyes only. Now again, I'm going to do the same screenshot. Let me do the screenshot and share it with you. And here's the same message. This is with SMS code. So in order for me to view it on my cell phone, I've got to, I got to go click on view and it will open it up in, in my Google app. And it's asking for the, it's going to say send the passcode and it's going to send the passcode for me to open it up here. Let me see if I can do that the second time. I did, 817937. 817937, submit. And so it sent another passcode because I tried to open it on a different device and it let me view it. I can view it as a, and it tells me the same thing that I see over here. Exactly the same message and it tells me it's going to expire March 12th. Bottom line, you can send messages through Google Workspace and Gmail. You can turn on security. You can decide how long it lasts before the message goes away. Send it with a SMS text code or without an SMS text code. And the user it has to open it up in a Google uh, application, such as Gmail or Google uh, a browser, uh, before they can view it. It's a great feature to use. It works really good. Uh, I wish more people would use it myself. I'm Teddy Burris, your Google Workspace and Gmail strategist trainer and coach, and I hope you find this secure feature helpful for you.